Hey guys and welcome back to another video from my YouTube channel that is Vipin Sharma Biology Tutorials and in this video we are going to talk about another extra edge NCRT lectures which is going to be about the type of teeth in different kind of organisms this is going to be very very important from examination point of view before that I am going to tell you that I am active on an academy so you can follow me by uh, on an academy by clicking on the link given in the description below okay and you can download the official an academy's education app from google play store for better learning experience you can follow me by clicking on this icon and after that you can watch all my videos on molecular basis of inheritance which are going to be very 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 beneficial for you guys so let's start our lecture on type of teeth okay so there are various kind of teeth in different kind of organisms so humne baat ki thi humans mein when we have talked about human teeth at that time we have talked about some type of dentitions in case of human so let's talk about them first because we know about them very well right so the very first thing is going to be heterodont dentition we know very well that human possess different type of teeth such as in incisors canines premolars and molars so the organisms that have different type of teeth or we can say more than one type of teeth are heterodont in dentition for example mammals or we can simply say humans so most of the mammals have heterodont dentition just opposite to that there is homodont dentition in which all the type of teeth are same ya to sare ke sare incisors honge ya sare ke sare canines honge us hisab se the dentition is going to be homodont and the examples are very interesting you have to memorize a word that is rap okay rap that is pisces amphibia okay and reptiles so pisces amphibia and reptiles or you can simply say fishes amphibia and reptiles are having homodont type of teeth okay after that in case of humans the dentition is diphyodont now what does di means di simply means two so the human possess two type of teeth or we can say two sets of teeth in their lifetime okay the first is milky teeth or deciduous teeth which used to fall after a certain period of time and then a permanent set of teeth aata hai so the two type of teeth are temporary or we can call it milky teeth or deciduous teeth and the second set of teeth is going to be the permanent one so do baar jinke daant aate hain in the whole lifetime are known as diphyodont and the organisms that will have only one set of teeth in their lifetime are obviously monophyodont so after learning about the humans we can easily derive all other names automatically but we have to understand the examples only so monophyodont means only one set in lifetime and the example is going to be kangaroo that is very important okay so the examples of homodont are fishes amphibians and reptile okay and after that the heterodont dentitions obviously mammals or human beings monophyodont kangaroo diphyodont humans because we have already read about it now polyphyodont as the name indicates poly which means that more than two in this case okay so more than two set of teeth matlab jinke teeth girte rehte hain aur aate rehte hain it means that their teeth are going to be fall after a certain period of time many times okay and they will rise again so the examples are going to be frog and some sort of lizards this is very important right some more type of teeth that are thicodont so we know about humans very well that these thicodont teeth are embedded in the socket of jaw bones and the examples are crocodile and humans obviously because we have humans we have studied so us example ko main bar bar include nahi kar raha so thicodont in which the teeth are you know embedded in the socket of jaw bones and it is having examples like humans and crocodiles or we can say mammals and crocodiles the next type of teeth is acrodont okay in acrodont the teeth are embedded in the flat surface of jaw bone such as frog and lizard this is very important so in acrodont the surface of jaw bone is flat so flat jo teeth honge wo wahan par present honge or the example is going to be frog and lizard and the last type is pleurodont in pleurodont dentition the teeth are attached by their sides to the rim of jaw or in grooves so 
जो जॉ बोन्स होंगी उनके रिम में इधर इन रिम और इन द ग्रूव्स ऑफ दैट पर्टिकुलर जॉ सम टीथ आर एम्बेडेड एंड दैट टीथ इज यू नो जस्ट अटैच नॉट एम्बेडेड बिकॉज इफ इट इज एम्बेडेड इट इज गोइंग टू बी थीकोडोंट सो हियर आई वुड लाइक टू क्लियर द कन्फ्यूजन दैट इन दिस केस द टीथ आर नॉट एम्बेडेड If they are embedded in the socket of jaw bone, that is known as thecodont. Here, it is just present in the groove or rim, are firmly attached, okay, by their sides. And the example is going to be lizard. So let's have a look again. Homodont simply means single type of teeth. Examples are rap. Heterodont simply means different type of teeth such as incisors, canine molars, premolars. In case of mammals, monophyodont only one single set in a lifetime. That is kangaroo. Diphyodont means two type of set or two sets in the lifetime. Example human. Polyphyodont means more than two type of set of teeth. That is frog and lizard. Thicodont means the tooth is embedded in the socket of jaw bones. That is mammals and crocodiles. Acrodont means it is present on the flat surface of jaw bone. That is frog and lizard. Pleurodont simply means teeth are attached by their side, जो कि attach होंगे to the rim. or to the groove of jaw and the example is going to be lizard so these are different type of teeth sometimes they used to be asked in some sort of examination such as jipmer and aims so this is quite important from examination point of view so is pe ek alag se video banayi gayi hai i hope you like the video agar aapko pasand aayi samajh mein aayi then do hit like button and if you are watching my video for the very first time and you found it beneficial then share this video with your friends and tell them to subscribe my channel thank you so much and stay tuned